All right, before I tell you how you can make it, here's what I, how I made it. Okay, I used salt that you, I would use at the dinner table, and I put food coloring. So this green is this one. This yellow is, the, it's kind of a lime color. I used this one. And then I used this blue, this beautiful blue, um, for this one right here. All right, so, and just, I used quite a few drops in here. And if you want, you can just do one. And then after I shake it up, I put a, um, a scent, a smell in there. Same kind of smells that you can use when you're, if you're making soap. All right, on to how you can make it. All right, so we're making our own bath salts and you can use this kind of soap. Now this is kind of soap if you're making bath bombs. So you'll use this. Now, if you don't have it, you can use rock salt, kosher salt, or salt that you have at the table, all right? So, and then you'll need, um, so you'll need, lick, you'll need fragrance, um, a jar, a spoon, spoon is, um, you'll see why we'll need a spoon, okay? And a measuring cup for measuring the salt, but I didn't. So, so here's, it says use one, one and a half fourth cups of fragrance, but here's the thing, I didn't do it, I just, did a couple like couple of drops in there so if you need more you can add more it's totally up to you um, and then so this book has different soaps recipes and stuff and it's this book right here all right on to how you make it first you have a jar now this jar looks awesome cool now I'm giving this to my um, a friend, and so what you do, you get a spoon. See, lovely spoon, gorgeous. Okay, now put it in. Let's see if I make it in. Woohoo! Made it in. All right, it looks like I want to add a little bit more. So first I added this color, then when I was done, I added that color, then I added that color. Just the same way you guys saw with the spoon. I just, and then at the end I patted it with the spoon. I didn't touch it with my hands. 